welcome everybody to my channel you asked me about what kind of machine or everything accessory you wanted to buy and now i come to the shop i want to show you everything here and i'm here hello Mr. how are you I'm how are good. you miss leah thank you it's nice to see you thank you welcome to red Deer sewing center mm -hmm. okay here we sell all uh various kinds of uh, sewing machines and sewing notions everything you need for your sewing from sewing to embroidery to quilting, even to uh, cutting machines like mm -hmm. scanner cut, mm -hmm. we have them here. We have books, we have buttons, we have zippers, we have lights, mm -hmm. we have uh, stabilizers, you know, just name it. Anything you need, thread, yeah. needles, everything you need for sewing. It's mm -hmm. a, a one-stop shop. So we not only sell it in store, we, of course, we always want to come to the store to visit us, yeah. but we also do online. You can go to reddearsewing.com, okay, there you can contact us, there you can see all of the machines we sell, you know, as we have them in stock, we put them on there, and uh, we also see some of the accessories also on there. Most of the accessories are not there yet, but you can come to the store, if there's anything you need or call us, uh -huh. our contact information is there online. Apart from new machines that you see in the store, we also have, you know, the reconditioned machines. Uh -huh. You know, some people call them used, but we call them reconditioned because really the machine, once uh, once they are in good mechanical working order, mm -hmm. they can serve you for a long time. Yeah. And when somebody brought it, brings it in, we make sure that they are reconditioned, you know, back to almost new and uh, are ready for your use. Okay. okay. Thank you to accept your, our invitation here. You're yes. Welcome. And we hope all the questions we was asking about machine and all accessory. We're gonna to talk to you today. We're gonna to give you all the detail about the machine for the beginners to the professional, okay? So let's stand with us and we're gonna have all the link below for if you wanna order online or you wanna have the address or you can phone to have all other information you need because here you have a good quality and services after you have your machine. Now, talking about machines, we carry basically four major brands. We carry the Genomi, mm -hmm. we carry the Broder, we carry uh, Faf and Singer. Mm -hmm. Okay, so this, for instance, is a Genomi, uh, it's a Broder machine. Okay, the front, starting from the lowest one that we carry, which is a mechanical machine. This is strictly mechanical because you, you turn, you turn dials, for instance, to change your stitches, okay? But it's a very beautiful machine because it comes also with an extension table. Mm -hmm. So for a very beginner sewer, somebody who has not sewn before, it's an excellent machine to learn how to sew and to use it to create uh, the garment. Mm -hmm. Now, then comes this next one. This is a, it's an electronic machine or what you can call computerized. Even though it has a dial, but the dial is to select all these stitches. So this machine has uh, 80 different stitches, as you can see here, some nice, beautiful decorative stitches. And all the machines, most of them actually have a free arm. Okay, so you can take the accessory case out, mm -hmm. so you can sew pants, uh, sleeves, and and uh, yeah. and arms and stuff like that. Okay. Mm -hmm. And when they come with, uh, when they don't come with uh, extension table like this. You can you can buy them to add to extend your working working surface. Okay, now again, all the machine we sell here, they will go through nine layers of denim. It doesn't matter whether it's this small machine or the most expensive one. So thick wow. fabric. Thick mm -hmm. fabric, yes. Mm -hmm. When you get to some, they can go through twenty layers of denim. I'll point out to you when we get to that one. So, okay. and then the machines progress. You know, in order of uh, complexity and price, mm -hmm. as it goes. Mm -hmm. This one, for instance, is a very good machine. A lot of people like it. One, because it has a bigger throat. Mm -hmm. You can see the work area here is bigger than that one. Yeah. Okay. It has 100 stitches. It also has a lettering whereby you can embellish your designs, mm -hmm. you know, with, uh, with names and stuff like that. Now, next one is this one. It's also a brother. The major difference between these two is that this one has, of course, many more stitches. As you do front and back sewing like this. Yeah. But this one also do sideways. Oh. 
So by doing sideways, some of these uh, decorative stitches come out like embroidery. They come out bold and big mm -hmm. because you can extend your... Let me see example. So, okay. when I talk about uh, sideways sewing, for instance, so if you look at this pattern, this kind of pattern, mm -hmm. when you do it on a regular sewing machine, this is what you get. Okay. Okay? That's what you get. But when you do it on this machine with a sideways sewing, you get the same pattern as big as that. Okay, so it looks like, although it's not embroidery, mm -hmm. but it looks like embroidery. Mm -hmm. Okay? So that's the advantage of that. Okay. Then when you talk about, it has 100 stitches. Mm -hmm. So that is, for example, straight sewing, zigzag. So, yes, I will tell you what that means. So let's use this basic one. Mm -hmm. So it has all your basic, what they call utility stitches, which are your straight stitches. In different positions, mid, uh, center, left, right, needle positions. It has your zigzag. It has your mending stitch. So that is the zigzag, but with a little, uh, little straight in between to mm -hmm. do mending. Mm -hmm. It has uh, your satin stitches. Satin stitches are stitches you also use for mending and for stretch fabric mm -hmm. to make sure that your fabric, stretch fabric, are, uh, your stitches are intact when you stretch your fabric. It has, uh, you know, hemming stitches, uh, blind hems, and stuff like that, okay? So a lot of uh, utility stitches, of course, but a lot of satin stitches, a lot of buttonhole stitches. So you can do buttonholes on this machine? Yes, you can do buttonholes. Mm -hmm. All the machines I've shown you so far, starting from this little one, all the way, will do one step buttonhole. You don't have to do four step. It's one step, you just put a foot on, you pull down the lever and you press the button. Mm -hmm. And it does all back. the corners. Yeah. It does everything button. for you. One so step. that is mm -hmm. one step. That is one step. Do now, they do buttons? Yes. The machines also do buttons. They are button foot. You just place your button on your on your machine and place the foot on and they, they tack your button mm -hmm. for you. Okay. Another thing I didn't mention is that all these computerized machines, okay, you can run them without using the presser foot. Okay. You can unplug the presser foot. They have a button, start stop button is called. You press that, you can use that to run the machine. Or if you decide to use it, you can use your presser foot as well. Mm. Right? And all of them also do have speed control. Okay. So you can control your speed of how you sew. You don't have to use your foot to control. Even when you have your foot pedal plugged in, the speed control still controls the speed. Okay. of your sewing okay now let's try and finish up the broader side now above this we do have a couple of other machines over there we have this is a nq900 we have the 1300 and we have uh, the 2450 which is a bigger machine for quilters of course we have uh, the big uh, lumina which is a embroidery machine as well as sewing now this is a little combination machine so this does both sewing and embroidery, as well as for quilting. Okay, so you can see the embroidery, uh, embroidery attachment on it. Okay, you can take that one out and put the regular sewing attachment. Okay, and we do have one like this also, which is only embroidery. It doesn't do sewing, just embroidery. On this machine, I can see Disney. Mm -hmm. Can you tell us about? Disney on this machine. Okay, so uh, broader, broader machines have uh, an exclusive right to Disney license. So they put that on some of their machines so you can make Disney characters, you know, like uh, Donald Duck, mm -hmm. characters like that. So you can make mini, mini Mouse, you know, all the Disney characters. Mm -hmm. They're built into the machine because you have the license. So you can make that for yourself at home. Use it to embellish your 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 designs and your garments, okay? And that's quite great, good for kids as well. People love them to make them for their kids, on their kids' garments. Can I do a design bigger than this one on this machine? So on this particular machine, yes, because this is a bigger machine. Uh, you can use a hoop of this size, okay? Mm. This will do whatever. 
size uh, of fabric you put in this in this hoop you can make a bigger bigger design mm -hmm. so the bigger the machine the bigger the design you can make now let me take before we finish on the brother let me take you to some bigger brother machines mm -hmm. on this side you can see the machine mm -hmm. so we have this uh, mm -hmm. this is the nq 1300 that i mentioned this also this is the, the one higher than the than the 900 mm -hmm. also does sideways sewing all the bigger machines do sideways sewing okay this also comes with uh, extension table like the other ones like this extension table you see here okay and uh, it has more features than the other one i showed you there and this is a, a one step ahead of this one again that is the brother 2450 okay that machine you know, it's uh, where it's much lower back with us because it has a bigger work area, as you can see. That's a bigger throat, mm -hmm. okay? Bigger screen, mm -hmm. meaning you can do a lot more with a touch screen than the smaller machines, okay? And it has a big uh, extension table as well. So this extension table allows you to be able to work with your big quilt, you know, comfortably. This is a 2450. It also has a senior one, which is a 3050. Okay, the 3050 has the laser guide. Okay, so if you are trying to follow a straight line or when you are quilting, the laser guide can help you with that and some additional features that the 2450 doesn't have. Okay, now, on the top of the line for brother is this machine here. Mm -hmm. So the top of the line for brother is this uh, Luminaire, mm -hmm. Luminaire SP2. Okay, you see, wow. it's a massive machine as you can mm -hmm. see. Okay, this is uh, as good as it gets when it comes to sewing and embroidery. Okay. Okay. So this machine, again, all the machines I've shown you that has embroidery for brother, they come with a Disney license. Mm -hmm. Okay, so you can do all the Disney characters. So this machine is uh, an excellent machine for sewing, for quilting, and for embroidery. You know, it's actually called the quilt broadly. Okay? okay, it has all the uh, space age technology that other machines don't have. For mm -hmm. instance, you can see the big screen like an iPad. Mm -hmm. Okay, you can see all your designs and all your stitches in different colors on the screen before you even sew them. It also has a projector when you put your fabric it will project whatever is on your screen onto your fabric so you can actually see it in real life how it's mm -hmm. going to look mm -hmm. whether it's going to match your fabric or not before you stitch them out you can also take uh, a line drawing for instance or whatever design you have you can scan them in you know you can some of the machines have a usb right. okay I'll, I'll talk about that so you can take a design like this you scan it into the machine right from underneath the the, uh, the needle mm -hmm. and you can then create something like this from that okay now this machine was used to create a big disney character like this mm -hmm. oh. okay so you can do something as big as that nice. right and you can do something as small as as this mm -hmm. okay curious judge or the Cinderella on the on the shoes that you see there. Okay, mm -hmm. so it's an excellent machine for doing everything you intend to do. This is the this is the biggest hoop mm -hmm. that comes with it. Okay? okay, so imagine what you can do with this in terms of embroidery or quilting. Mm -hmm. Okay, and no other machine has a hoop as big as this. Mm. Now talking about USB. So all the embroidery machines mm -hmm. and some non-embroidery comes with a USB port, okay, that you can take your design and plug it in. Mm -hmm. And so they're already designed on the machine themselves, but if you want more that you can buy from uh, other places, you can plug mm -hmm. them in and, mm -hmm. and use them on your machine. Okay. Now, that one is question I want to ask is, when we want to do like broader like that, do we use one thread at the time or we just fix? Okay. Yes. So, for this kind of machines, mm -hmm. most uh, uh, domestic machines, they are single thread. Okay. Well, single, single needle basically is the needle that matters because oh. you can have a thread spool that has 
like in this case you have two spools mm -hmm. but you can use one for instance to wind your bobbin okay. and one but one what matters is your is your needle mm -hmm. okay mm -hmm. for embroidery for instance yes. there are machines that are more used for like a business mm -hmm. or a small business yes. that have like six needles yeah. ten needles okay okay mm -hmm. for embroidery so that way you don't have to be changing your thread every, every time every time yes yeah wow. okay mm -hmm. so that is broader mm -hmm. the machines are very robust as you can see so this is the five uh, uh, quilt expression 720 it's also a very high-tech machine mm -hmm. it has the sideways sewing as well that i mentioned on the broader yeah okay and uh, next to that one is the performance uh, icon over there mm -hmm. so performance icon looks similar to what you are looking at in front of you here mm -hmm. they are essentially the same sewing machine because performance icon only do sewing but this, this one, one is a creative icon okay whenever you see creative in fab it means it does embroidery just embroidery no okay. embroidery in and addition sewing. to sewing yes. oh, okay sewing and embroidery so it does sewing and embroidery yeah, and this is the creative icon one mm -hmm. okay they just came out with the well they're coming out with the creative icon two mm -hmm. which we has all sort of advanced features as well it will have the scanning it will have the projection mm -hmm. it also has voice uh voice recognition so you can talk oh, to the machine wow right mm -hmm. <laughs> so that's that's the like creative the <laughs> creative icon to come in okay i come in this uh this for fall mm -hmm. now that is uh fab. now let's come to the, the we have this uh, brother scanner cut as well mm -hmm. so here you can do a lot of creative work mm -hmm. you know you can cut fabric so as you see it says cut through virtually everything you can imagine you can cut paper, you can cut fabric, mm -hmm. so you can scan your design mm -hmm. and then cut it into shape, you know, oh. things like that, and a lot more. Okay. okay. Now, coming to the Genomi brand, you know, Genomi has a lot of machines. They, the, mm -hmm. they are the biggest one, biggest machine manufacturer, yeah. and probably the oldest. Okay. Oh, that's why I want to ask a question. If you can do like a few just history about Genomi, because I noticed here we have more <laughs> Genomi than than the rest. So yes, I are, don't know if, if you can. Yeah, we are a big Genomi uh, dealership. Mm -hmm. So Genomi is celebrating their hundred years anniversary this year. Oh, okay, and wow. you can see some machines that we have shown you mm -hmm. that are used to have uh, made to commemorate that anniversary. Uh, they have a lot of uh, various. Uh, a brand that's starting from the very beginner to the very yeah. advanced mm -hmm. so in terms of a combination machine for genomi this is the biggest machine okay it's called the memory craft uh, 15,000. so it's an embroidery machine it's a sewing machine it's a quilting machine so everything is combined again mm -hmm. you can see the big screen yeah it has a lot of features a lot of uh, you know mm -hmm. a lot of technology also built into it mm -hmm. Right, so that's the Dynamic 15, Memory Craft 15,000. It has a big throat as well, big mm -hmm. work area, mm -hmm. which is uh, uh, 11, 11 inches, plus it has a lot more area on this yes, side as yeah. well. Okay. And then on the side of it, another combination machine is, is, is part of the Skyline series. Mm -hmm. So this series, uh, they are made, they look similar. It's called the Skyline. This is the Skyline S9. Okay, this is also a combination machine. It has both sewing and embroidery, and you can use it for quilting as well. Uh -huh. Okay, the difference between this and that one, this is a smaller machine than that. Yeah. And you can see the throat size. Okay, it's about mm -hmm. eight and three quarters inches, smaller than the memory craft, which is 11 inches. So this is also a combination machine. You can do your quilting on it as well. Mm -hmm. Now, let's go to the and the question when they say smallest is just about the size or about the motor tool like the engine is it different is it more powerful or more definitely yeah. so uh, -huh. uh when you talk about uh so there are many features that differentiate the machine from each other mm -hmm. some of them we just mentioned one of the big ones is the work area okay which is kind of a real estate when you think about it in terms of real estate mm -hmm. okay you can you can build a small house you can build a big house so yeah. that's the first thing that determines your price what is the size yeah. of the work area mm -hmm. okay that is one the other things are all the other features that it has okay how many stitches what kind of stitches 
what kind of technology and so on. Okay. So all the machines, all the sewing machines will sew we store a stitch. Yeah. For instance, they will sew a straight mm -hmm. stitch. Mm -hmm. Okay. So and that's why for beginners, you know, you just need basic machine. Yeah. Now as you go at as you get advanced and you do a lot of uh, designs and projects, then you need more. Mm -hmm. Okay. And that is when you start going you know you start upgrading into mm -hmm. into bigger machines now in terms of power obviously again you don't expect the same power in a bigger machine as we see in a small machine okay mm -hmm. so these machines have more they have bigger motors mm -hmm. in them more penetration power and when we talk about penetration power let's turn around to this other machine here now this machine mm -hmm. is a top of the line machine also for genomic it's called the continental m7 Okay, yeah. this is a very powerful machine. Mm -hmm. Now, all the ones I've mentioned to you so far, they are free arm machine, but this one is a flatbed. Okay. Okay, it's a flatbed. It's yeah. more like a professional industrial kind of machine. Yeah. Okay, it's, it's, has a, it's packed full of features as well. Mm -hmm. And this is one I was telling you can go through 20 layers of denim. So it has a big motor in there, mm -hmm. and it has a very high penetration power. Okay. Okay. Wow, nice. So, and this machine and the top of the line I show you there, the 15,000, mm -hmm. they have independent bobbin winding as well. So you don't have to untread your needle to wind your bobbin. So they have a mm -hmm. bobbin winding separate mm -hmm. from, from the, so kind of a different, a separate motor mm -hmm. to wind your bobbin oh. than the motor for your running your machine. Okay. Wow. So beside the, the Genomi mm -hmm. is the embroidery machine. So this is the Janome embroidery only. Okay, only. Just, just yes. embroidery. Mm -hmm. Using um, a Janome 550E. Mm -hmm. Okay, so you can see the kind of embroidery that it like has done. All we can make with. Yeah, you can all make all this embroidery stuff. Nice. And we also used it for doing this uh, Kimberbell uh, embroidery mm -hmm. pouch. Mm -hmm. Okay, and so because it's embroidery only, it has a larger work area. And yeah. Janome is the only one that has this kind of big work area for embroidery machine mm -hmm. okay and uh, big hoop so it has a uh, you can put a large hoop in it mm -hmm. for bigger uh, bigger projects now back here you come to some other kind of uh, uh, sewing machines mm -hmm. so this is a genome as well is the genome is the 700 also a professional grade sewing machine mm -hmm. you can see it also it's like the big one there it's all solid metal. Mm -hmm. Okay, this is used by professional sewers, people who sew for a living. Okay, okay. more power. It only is, it doesn't have as much space, space yeah. workspace like the Continental M7. Mm -hmm. That one is almost 14 inches of throw space. Okay, this one is uh, about uh, just mm -hmm. less than 11 inches. Mm -hmm. Okay, it's also a powerful professional grade machine. Mm -hmm. On the side here, is the Janome 9450 mm -hmm. also a memory craft? Now, all the memory craft, as I said, they have 11 inches of throat. Mm -hmm. Okay, you can see this one as well 11 inches. But it's also a machine that is uh, very loved, much loved by quilters because of all the features it has for quilting. Yeah. Also, very, a lot of professional sewers also use it. People who sew for a living, tailors, uh, people who do mending, mm -hmm. and so on and so forth. They use this machine a lot. It has a lot of features like this uh, additional light, you know, that you can just pull out. You can open the head. So mm -hmm. most of the advanced bigger machines, you can open their head like this, really yeah. can be able to see what's it's in there and, yes. and clean them. Yeah. Okay. It has uh, features like uh, tapering. So it has uh, many, uh, three different kinds of uh, plate: mm -hmm. a straight, straight needle plate. Uh, a regular zigzag plate okay. and uh, a, a HP plate, the high performance plate. Mm -hmm. And we it use also, that for. So it's for you know high performance job like fast jobs, okay. jobs like uh, when you're quilting, like freehand quilting, free motion quilting, for instance. Mm -hmm. And all these uh, uh, higher machines come with uh, for genomic come coming with uh, AccuFeed. So AccuFeed is a built-in like a built-in working foot. Mm -hmm. Okay. Where you just it's a different foot than this. Okay. Yeah, uh, I'll have to pull the accessories to show you that. But it has uh, it has a different work uh, a, a, a foot that's a working foot. Let me show you that. Okay. 
the aquifer looks like this, oh. this this is the single one okay okay it's like a built-in working fruit mm -hmm. it also has the twin one the mm -hmm. double so you just put that fruit in the in yeah. the in the mm -hmm. holder there mm -hmm. okay and then this is like actually this is the high performance one it's called the aquifer aquifer flex mm -hmm. okay professional grade fruit uh, and this one we use for embroidery or for what? No, it's just for sewing. Oh, for sewing. So this machine doesn't oh, do embroidery. Sewing. Okay. Yeah, this machine doesn't do embroidery. It's only sewing. Oh, just and, sewing and all and, that And quilting, yes. Oh, quilting. Okay. Yes. That's what it does. Nice. Okay. Uh, the 200. It's like the baby to the to the one we just saw. Okay. Okay. Again, it's a memory craft. It has 11 inches of uh, workspace. Mm -hmm. You know, 11 inches of truth right here. Mm -hmm. Okay, so but it's, it has less features than the than the 9450. One of the things you see right away is that the screen mm -hmm. is not a touch screen, like okay. that one. It has buttons here. Oh. Okay, but this is a mm -hmm. special edition uh, memory craft. Now, if you remember at the beginning, I mentioned to you that Janome is celebrating the hundred years anniversary. Yeah. This, year. Mm -hmm. this is one of the machines mm -hmm. they made to make commemorate that anniversary. Oh. Okay. So this is the fifteen twenty two PG. Mm -hmm. Okay. It's uh does that look like simple? It's for beginners. So this for... is for beginners basically yeah. as you okay. can see. Yes. It's a mechanical machine. Mm -hmm. But it's so it's so it's so nice that it has a separate uh, button, mm -hmm. separate dial for changing your stitch width. Yeah. Okay, so you can see it has three dials. This is for selecting your mm -hmm. stitch. This is for the length and this is for the width. Okay. Nice. Now, if you go back there. So this is the rest of the Skyline series, as I mentioned earlier. Mm -hmm. uh, the other time we saw the Skyline 9. This one is the Skyline 6. Okay. Before okay. this one, we have the Skyline 7, which we don't, we are not showing today. But uh, this is the Skyline 6. The Skyline 7 is uh, also a bit more advanced than this one. Okay. Nice. So it has a... Ah, this is uh, what we can do with... Uh, yeah. All. Exactly. The Skyline 6 is, is the first machine that comes with the AccuFeed mm -hmm. in the series. So when you're talking about hierarchy, this is the first machine, the lowest machine that has the AccuFeed. The one lower than this, the Skyline 5, doesn't have the AccuFit. Okay, this one will use the regular working foot. Okay, so mm -hmm. that's another difference right there. Uh, again, it has button-like touch, uh, just like the 8200 we saw. Yeah. You know, it's not like a touch screen, uh, big screen. Mm -hmm. um, if you ask the question about like touch cream and the button, which one can live longer? Or the, the, I mean, it's just a matter of, uh, of convenience, mm -hmm. okay? So touch screen gives you more uh, freedom to select yeah. and choose stuff, mm -hmm. but buttons are fixed, right? Yeah, you I just see. have to press one button press to do button. certain okay. things, mm -hmm. yeah? Now, I've not shown you mm -hmm. the smaller Genomi machine. I think we should do that mm -hmm. before we come to the quilting machine. Oh, okay. So when we talk about... Uh, and you can see there are a lot of them here on this uh, display. Mm -hmm. So this is the most basic uh, Genomi. You know, mm -hmm. apart from that anniversary edition one, this yes. is the most basic. Okay. This is called My Star, and it has uh, it's a mechanical machine again, mm -hmm. as you can see. It has uh, the dial for selecting your stitch, and the dial for sele selecting your type of uh, uh, you know width, which we select your you select your stitch A B C D to G. Whether it's the regular utility stitches or the satin stitches. Okay, the blue is the satin. So when you select the regular ones, your width will be within this range. And when you select the satin, you put it at SS. Mm -hmm. So that's your most basic machine. And then on the other side of it is the it's also a mechanical machine, but a more a little more advanced one. This is the Sowis uh, 725. Mm -hmm. Okay. It's a more heavy duty, more robust machine than the that, basic oh, one, good. right? Yeah. But all the machines, again, they are free arm. You can mm -hmm. take the accessory case out, yeah. so you Shall can show. Yeah. Pants or yeah. Jeans. yeah. Exactly. <laughs> right. And uh, it has more. It has more stitches than the basic one. Uh -huh. yeah. 
Okay, so it's also a mechanical machine. So for the beginners, like we was asking, if yes. it's a person never have to use the machine, they want to, it's a first machine for them. Yes. This is, this is a, a very good one. Okay. Exactly, mm -hmm. for, for a beginner. Mm -hmm. Who just wants to use mechanical to get started okay i will still introduce you to the computerized one just like i did for the brother yes okay yeah. but it depends it's a matter of preference mm -hmm. some people want to just you know get into the computerized and yeah. because of the all the ease, mm -hmm. ease it gives them and the functions yeah but some still want to do the mechanical, the mechanical one. it's also good mm -hmm. now this one is also a mechanical machine mm -hmm. okay so, but it's a heavy duty machine. As you can see it's called heavy HD three thousand. Oh, it's a heavy duty machine, more heavy duty than that. This one, a little more stitches again. Okay. But it's a very strong machine. Powerful, yeah. Okay. Also, a free ham. You can take out the accessory case. Mm -hmm. So that you have a. Okay. So you can take out the accessory case. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And this one here, you can open the head. Mm -hmm. So you have again access to the access. head. Okay. Smaller machines that we have seen so far, you cannot open the head. Oh, you have okay. to unscrew something. Yeah. To open to get into mm -hmm. that. Now, there's one that is like it's a small machine, mm -hmm. but it's like a transition between computerized and mechanic <laughs> yeah so even though it's a small machine it's, a, it's called the c30 genomi you know mm -hmm. it has 30 stitches so you can see because it's a little bit of uh, computerized it has some nice decorative stitches mm -hmm. and certain stitches okay but instead of turning dials here you just use the buttons to select your to select the your stitch. stitches mm -hmm. up and down okay and uh, you have this button here also that you, know, you can use to tie your stitch or uh, instead of using for the mechanical you'll have to sew in reverse to tie the stitch but for this one you can just use that button mm -hmm. now that takes me to the computerized mm -hmm. okay starting from this one the Janome 5100 mm -hmm. it's a special machine now just like you saw on the other model you see that this one also has uh a sliding sliding thing here which is a feed, speed control mm -hmm. okay it has the start stop button so you don't have to use a presser foot if you don't want to oh if you do mm -hmm. this speed control still controls your speed mm -hmm. okay oh, nice. again it has the, the locking stitch mm -hmm. and the needle up needle down now it's a special because it comes with a lot of stitches that's under stitches mm -hmm. it also has a, a extension tray okay. that comes with it Nice. and a lot of nice uh, dish, uh, extras mm -hmm. like the quilting kit and so on now next is this uh, genomi 3160 mm -hmm. this comes in various, various variety but this red one was made specially for uh, the Quilt of Valor Canada it's a charity uh, kind of project for genomi so oh, for every nice. machine of this they sell mm -hmm. some amount of money goes to Quilt of Valor oh, nice. Canada okay mm -hmm. now difference you can see already between this and that even though they come with the same uh extension table mm -hmm. about the same working area but this one comes with additional thing your scissors oh for cutting your thread, cutting thread there. Okay. right there okay nice other than that all the other features are the same it has the speed control mm -hmm. it has the start stop button it has the stitch tying uh, button and the needle up needle down okay now that is the other one on this side now before we come to this one, is this one? This is uh, uh, Janome forty one twenty. Okay, forty one twenty is an advancement on thirty one sixty. Okay. It has almost everything the same except that one. It has more stitches. So it's at one sixty has sixty stitches. This one has uh, one hundred and twenty stitches. And it has uh, a button here for twin needle. Oh. So you can do twin needle sewing. Okay. Isn't that nice? Yeah. So it also has a quilting kit that comes with the extension table as well. Mm -hmm. Now, the one above that one is this uh, machine right here. Mm -hmm. This is the 5300. Now, this uh, 
All these machines I'm showing you now, all the all the um, computerized I'm showing you here mm -hmm. on the Genomi, they are called the QDC, the mm -hmm. Quilters Decorative Computerized oh, okay. Machine, QDC. QDC. And as you can see, they almost have the same working area. Mm -hmm. Now, this one has something additional, apart from the fact that it has many more stitches, mm -hmm. about 400 stitches in total. Mm -hmm. Okay, it also has uh, this magnifying glass that comes with it. Oh, okay. to help to... Yeah, to magnify it. when you are threading your needle yeah. or to see your stitches and stuff oh, like that. Oh, nice. Now, it also wow. comes with the... I don't know if you have noticed some of the other machines, bigger machines we have looked at. They come with a uh, knee lift. Mm -hmm. Okay, the knee lift helps you to... So the smaller machines don't come with that. Okay. But starting from this machine, of course, they have the knee lift. Mm -hmm. So when you are sewing, it helps you to keep your hands on your fabric. To oh, guide your fabric so okay. if you want to raise your your foot for instance to, okay. to pivot mm -hmm. or to make a turn mm -hmm. you don't have to you don't have to stop yes okay you just use your knee you to don't lift you it need to, yeah, okay yeah so all the big machines starting from this has it. okay okay so nice. that is genomi on, on the on the side there you see one uh, elna machine okay elna is also uh, another version of uh, the genomic brand basically mm -hmm. okay so this one is similar to the one i just showed you the 5300 mm -hmm. except that it doesn't have the knee lift but all the other features are like the 5300 okay nice now one thing i'm not so one of the machines we are not talking about so far is the sagas mm -hmm. okay or what they call overlock machines mm -hmm. so any sewers anybody that make garments uh works with jerseys or jersey like fabric mm -hmm. or T-shirts and uh, underwears, yeah. you know, sportwears. You need these machines, you know, because they're, they're used for construction of fabric. Mm -hmm. You know, so we have a lot of them. Starting from that one in the box, there is a broader overlock machine. Mm -hmm. Then we have a couple of Genomi, as you can see. Mm -hmm. Now, they all have come with different features. This is the most basic Genomi, for instance. Uh, Saga that we have right now mm -hmm. for thread, for thread, it's called the 4DLB. Mm -hmm. Now, the one next to it is called the FA4, which is the free arm. You can open that, you can okay. so you can do a free arm just like the sewing machine. Okay, you can do for the for you know sleeve. Hand, for yeah. sleeve mm -hmm. and for your pants, pants and stuff like that. Yeah, okay, they can go in there and come in here. You're starting to get into the professional grade kind of machine. Mm -hmm. So, this is called the Pro 4DX. Okay, a lot of a very robust machine that most professional sewing staff in the in the uh, sewing room. Also oh. for thread. Mm -hmm. Then comes to this one. This is the air thread. Okay, so it's uh, an advancement on the Pro Four, but those ones you have to thread manually, you know, using your tweezers. Mm -hmm. But on this one, you know, you thread them by air. You just so most people find it difficult to thread their loopers. Mm -hmm. Okay, it's still a side gear, okay, with four thread, but your loopers can be threaded by air. Okay, oh, you just you just, just put in your thread in that okay. in those holes, and then press a button, and the air just and then the thread. air just just thread your loopers for you. Oh, nice! And for the needle, there's a needle threader right here mm -hmm. that you so use okay. to thread the, the needle. needle. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. When I see this one, which uh, machine are doing this? So all the sagas can do this. This is called the flat lock. Mm -hmm. Okay, so you can use just a sample here. Yeah. You can do flat locking like this. Mm -hmm. It's uh, one of the techniques. On oh, the, that's machine. On the saga. Yes. Okay. Ordinarily, they do things like uh, sagging the end, the edges of your machine. Mm -hmm. And that's why we say they're for. I mean, the edges of your fabric. Mm -hmm. That's why we say they're for fabric construction. Okay. Yeah. At the same time, they can do rolled hem. I don't know if I have a sample of rolled hem here. Yeah, something like this. It's called the rolled hem. Oh, okay. Okay. The smallest one. Yeah, and here you see the flat lock. And for the other ones we're going to show you are the overlocking machine. Mm -hmm. I mean, sorry, the, the cover stitch. Cover stitch, okay. Cover stitch. Mm -hmm. It's just uh, something, like, something like this. Okay. Okay, and that you see mostly in your t-shirt. Yeah. When you look, even in your shirt, mm -hmm. you can see it is done by a cover stitch. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now, 
we talk about this air trader, the Janemi AT2000. The uh, alternative to it is the Elna version. Okay, so this Elna is exactly the same thing as that one. Also, also air trading. Okay, so it's essentially the same as that one, but this is the Elna version of it. Mm -hmm. And uh, we do carry also mm -hmm. some Juki. So this is the basic Juki Saja. Mm -hmm. And this one again is an air trade. Juki Air Trader, it's just like the ones that we saw on the Genomi. Mm -hmm. It also does uh, air trading. All of these machines I've shown you are four trades, sizes. Yeah. Okay, you can do two trades with them, you can do uh, three trades mm -hmm. and up to four. Okay, so now we come to the cover stitch. Yeah. This is a Juki cover stitch machine. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. So the cover stitch is the one make the both side like this huh? now so no? the one the cover stitch generally don't do that okay i will tell you the one that does that okay. so the cover stitch will do the edge the the air uh, the the sleeve of your shirt for instance of your like, t-shirt like that yeah where mm -hmm. you have uh, like two uh two two uh, stitches so, uh -huh. on the outside and then you have the the oh, surgeon inside on the inside mm -hmm. okay that's what cover stitch will do for you mm -hmm. but this machine this brother cover stitch okay it's also called a top cover stitch so it can do both sides like that at the same time okay right mm -hmm. so you, you can do the regular cover stitch mm -hmm. or you can do this oh okay. right so you find yeah. this mostly in sportswear yes you know in yes. sports pants yes. and stuff like that yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. so this one will do that for mm -hmm. you and you can see that it's a five thread. Okay, yeah. <laughs> Different and from how the, many needles they are using? So it's uh, two needles. Mm -hmm. Now you can use three needles. So okay. what you see on a the shirt there is two, two needles. needles yeah. But you can see on this machine, you can see three needles there, right? Mm -hmm. So you have three needle thread and two looping thread, two, lo two loopers. Oh, okay. So when you have the three needles, you can do the three stitches on mm -hmm. the top, and then yeah, the you have the part. looping on the Inch bottom. Back. Okay. Right? So. That's the difference between the top cover stitch and the regular cover stitch. Nice. <laughs> nice, nice, nice. Okay. You put it on a on a frame, on a quilting frame. So basically you run it manually yourself. Okay, by so quilt. How you call it, please? Quilting. Okay. So so the machine itself is a it's a regular sewing machine, but it's a straight stitch sewing machine. Mm -hmm. It doesn't have all the nice stitches that the other machines have mm -hmm. just those three stitches oh, okay so you mostly they use usually it for, we use that for is it for the blanket or for yeah this is your this, yeah this is your quilt your blanket basically oh, if you want to call okay. it that uh -huh. where's your quilt something like this okay so you make this of different designs mm -hmm. on it now these three stitch machines also are used for making bags because they're also very powerful oh. and they're also very fast wow yeah they're very they are faster than regular sewing machine so it's to sew the bag or it's just to do to the sew the bag okay to sew wow. the bag so nice. they're faster they're stronger mm -hmm. right because they only do one thing straight stitch okay? okay so we have different versions of that is the elna we have the genomi which is called the hd9 mm -hmm. and we have the brother right professional quilting machine mm -hmm. okay yeah. this is as good as it gets Wow. It's called the Quinix 21 Pro, made by the Grace Company. Mm -hmm. Okay, you can see the throat here, throat size here is 21 inches. Okay, no sewing machine will come close to that. Yeah. 21 yeah. inches, and this one is equipped with the robotics, mm -hmm. or what we call the Q QCT Quilters Creative Touch. So you can run the machine by yourself. Mm -hmm. I mean, the machine can run by, by itself. You it just, you just, just uh, you know, click some buttons on your tablet mm -hmm. and. Set Choose the design, the design and then it will go. So you can do bigger quilt. So this this frame can go up to twelve feet. So what we have set up here, you are seeing now is seven feet, but it can go more than that. Up to twelve feet. Wow. So you can do king size quilt. Okay. Yeah. King size blanket, yeah. Yes. Okay. Wow. And other than that, you know, you, you can you can also get this light uh, stand with it. It's an LED light stand. Okay. Other than that, we do have a lot of thread, mm -hmm. regular thread for regular sewing. Or mm -hmm. Okay. He didn't study. He hasn't studied yet. Okay. okay. We have the rayons, mm -hmm. rayon uh, type. 
We have the regular polyester thread. Mm -hmm. We have the gutterman, uh, the upholstery thread. Sorry. Mm -hmm. Okay. We have the sajer thread for using on those uh, oh, on those sajers and uh, okay. cover stitch machines. Mm -hmm. have different so what's the difference them. with the regular thread and the sajer? This one is heavier or it's like more lighter? I don't know. It's uh, it's not about being light. It's mm -hmm. about uh, uh, so this is polyester. Yes. So that one is uh, uh, most of them are. Either cutting or a mixture. Oh okay. yeah, okay. Hence for your mm -hmm. for making. Uh, mm -hmm. This is for, for sewing, yeah. but that's for sizing, okay. right? Good. So we have different kinds. We have the cancel ones. We mm -hmm. have the the maxi lock mm -hmm. stretch, mm -hmm. and we have the woolly nylon. Okay. Now, what on your back? At your back there, you see a lot of nice, beautiful colors. Mm -hmm. These are embroidery threads. Okay, these are embroidery threads. In different, mm -hmm. different oh, mix, we have the yes. isocord, we have the yeah. broader. So this is a result for yeah. the embroidery, uh, embroidery thread. Yes, we use. different kinds of threads. Mm -hmm. We have the variegated, we have the rayon, we have the metallic, okay, and so on. So these are the kind of uh, stitches you get out of them. Mm -hmm. Okay, mm -hmm. and then on that side, we have the orifill which are cutting threads okay quilters use that a lot for quilting mm -hmm. so if you are doing a cutting quilt mm -hmm. you use a like cotton thread, cotton thread. Mm -hmm. okay and other than that a lot of uh, as i said before a lot of uh, essential notions for for sewers mm -hmm. on this side starting from things like your uh, bobbins bobbin holder <laughs> box mm -hmm. to thread thread boxes okay okay and uh, patterns for for quilting, mm -hmm. okay. So pattern papers. And so uh, this pattern, where uh, uh, where we use this one on this big machine? Yes, or? on the oh, on okay. the big quilting machine. Mm -hmm. Yes, mm -hmm. the big quilting machine. So that's what you use to make all those quilt patterns. Mm -hmm. Right. If you don't have the the software to do that. And where you are there, you start seeing things like stabilizers for embroidery machines. Mm -hmm. Okay, these ones are marked for the scan and cut. For that scan and cut I mentioned earlier. Okay. Okay, and then there you see a lot of stabilizers, different kinds mm -hmm. of stabilizers. Okay, and also we have buttons. Mm -hmm. You know, you. Whoa, all nice and when you make garments, you need buttons. Yeah. <laughs> you need scissors. I mean, sorry, you need. Uh, you need uh, uh, zippers, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. So uh, buttons and on this side. Mm -hmm. We also have a mat for pressing mat. Okay. Okay. This, these are wool wool pressing mat, mm -hmm. different sizes. Okay. We have a uh, cutting mat and cutting uh, blade, uh, cutting roller cutters. Yes. Okay, for cutting your fabric. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. The question I want to ask, that's ruler, do we use just for a specific cutting or we can use for any kind of cutting design, any kind of... Uh... Whatever, as long as you can place your material on your on the mat, uh -huh. you can cut it with that. How many pieces is it used? Like... So this is a small quarter, this okay. one we cut, you know, uh, I, I don't know the, the exact uh, thickness, mm -hmm. it just, these are very sharp very sharp blade. Oh, okay. Uh, I don't think that's a specific. Uh, yeah, so we have to read inside to see how. Yeah. Okay. okay. And uh, one thing I also did mention are light. I mean, I have seen a lot of light here in the store. Mm -hmm. We carry a lot of light as well. Oh, yeah, also we, we so, you, so you can turn it on. Yeah, we sell the light basically. Okay. So people yeah. who want some more light in their sewing room, mm -hmm. you can buy all different kind of lights, either a table lamp mm -hmm. or the standing lamps. Okay, yeah, hold it here. exactly. Nice. Different lights. So, we also have uh, chairs. Oh, this oh. is nice chair. <laughs> oh, I like it. Comfortable chairs, mm -hmm. right? If you sit on it, you see how comfortable it is. Ooh, <laughs> nice. Very good on the bum yeah. and, and the back. Mm -hmm. And there's a height that is mm -hmm. perfect for you. Straight your, back, yes, everything. Nice too. Wow, okay. good. <laughs>
And we sell it that kind of chair too? Yes, we do. Oh, nice. In addition to the, the sewing cabinet, uh -huh. sewing tables, also books, educational books. Like this is, if you're just starting to do surging. Okay. You know, this surging, surging 101, it will teach you. That's a nice thing to know yeah, about it. Yeah, it will teach you about your surging mm -hmm. and about the type of... Uh, mm -hmm. Can we turn quickly? So, yeah, sure. okay. Tell you the type of things you can do. Mm -hmm. You can do with your surgery. Wow. Cool. Okay. Yeah. So, and that is that one. On the on the stand over there, we have a lot more other books. Yes. Okay. For well, like this one is for making face masks, making pillows. Mm -hmm. You know. A lot of uh, educational books. Mm -hmm. This, this one teach you. Mm -hmm. This one teaches you about your sewing machine. For instance, some of the uh, troubleshooting you can do yes. yourself. Yeah. Before bringing it to us to service. Mm -hmm. so yeah, that's really good for the for the beginner for everybody. Yes, yeah, for everybody small... actually. It's something you need to have in your yes. in your sewing room. Things, sure. Simple things like tension. Mm -hmm. Okay, how it, to it, fix it? It tell you how to how to adjust it mm -hmm. and what to look for. Mm -hmm. And if it goes beyond that, then you have to bring it to us here to service. Yes, because we have a workshop also in the back. Mm -hmm. We service all makes and models of uh, sewing machine. Mm -hmm. Okay, nice. starting from regular basic sewing machine to so industrial. Okay, okay. So those are books, and we do have like this one. I didn't mention this one to you. Mm -hmm. This is called this is called the Barracuda. Mm -hmm. That's the name of the machine. It's a semi-industrial sewing machine. Yeah, it's look heavy. It's look yeah. like <laughs> yeah. it's semi-industrial. So wow. you use these things for things like leather, oh. uh, tops, okay, yeah. upholstery. Mm -hmm. So it's a working foot and zigzag uh, machine. So it does three stitch and zigzag. Wow. With built-in nice. built-in working foot. Yeah. Okay. This is the this is the lever here. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Wow. Nice. Mm -hmm. Now, other than that, all the accessories that the sewers need, you know, from your uh, snaps, you know, your snaps where your where that you use to fasten mm -hmm. your mm -hmm. your your design, mm -hmm. all different kinds of snaps, to zippers, mm -hmm. okay, to zippers, to to patches, mm -hmm. even uh, accessory uh, totes to carry your to store your machine or to carry yeah. it, yeah, okay. We have fabric. You know, this ones are backing fabric for for quilting. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. We have fabric for making uh, making masks. Mm -hmm. So in Alberta, we have uh, the Calgary frames and the Edmonton oilers. Oh. So people who want to support their cloth yeah. can buy stuff okay. like that. Okay. Okay. So a lot of uh, accessories. You know, for the for the service. Mm -hmm. Marking pens. Uh, free block, free check, uh, thin cushions, mm -hmm. okay, so different kinds of scissors, pins, as I mentioned earlier, okay, all sorts of uh, pins and uh, and safety pins. Mm -hmm. uh, tip, tip measures, mm -hmm. different kinds. Yeah. Okay, different kinds of uh, scissors, embroidery scissors. Uh, we have the uh, thinking shears, all sort of different kinds, and uh, gloves. They call machine guys, and so on. So these are machines that have been, uh, you know, we have that have been traded in, and we have reconditioned them. Okay, so some lucky people will get to buy some good machines for a lower price if they cannot afford to buy new ones. So all the ones we've shown before now are new machines, but these are used machines that have been reconditioned, okay? We call them experienced machines. And behind them you see some other stuff. You have all sorts of needles here, okay? We have lights on the top. Uh, we have bobbins. We have, uh, you know, machine oil. Okay, we have the uh, machine, uh, it, the fabric conditioner, like a kind of stash. That's what you see over there, and so on. Okay, now when you, one advantage of buying from us, 
from a dealership like us is that uh, when you have problem with your machine, if you're still under warranty, we take care of that for you. So we deal with it here in the store and fix it for you or if we have to get to the manufacturer, we get to them on your behalf and you get the highest quality machine from us. If you buy from non-dealers or don't buy from us, then you're practically on your own. You have machinal problems, you have to take care of it by yourself, you have to contact the manufacturer by yourself and those machines you get from outside or you get second hand from somebody you know on Kijiji or wherever you don't have warranty on them you cannot go back to them and say oh come and fix my machine but with us we take care of all of that for you make sure you are up and running again if your machine has troubles okay um, and for warranty all the machines even the experience machines we sell mm -hmm. have warranty. Like these experience machines, we give you three months warranty. Mm -hmm. Okay, on parts that can be damaged. Whenever it is a, a, a user's error or things like tension, that is not a warranty thing. Mm -hmm. But anything that's part of the machine, then it's warranty for three months. For new machines, you have parts and labor warranty for one year. Some of the machines have two years. Okay, for all electronic parts at least one year you have all covered. And most of them have up to 25 years limited warranty. Okay, so on the chassis of your machine, it's guaranteed for 25 years to remain that way and to be to be there to work for you. Mm -hmm. Okay, now I didn't talk about the, mm -hmm. okay, a lot of rollers and irons. Okay, you cannot do a sewist and not have iron. Yeah. You need to press. So we have, sure. we have a nice uh, Ulisu iron, reliable. Baby Oliso. Okay, again, I move uh, the pressing mat, mm -hmm. different kinds of them. Mm -hmm. Okay, and then a lot of fabric here as well. A lot of nice, uh, nice fabric mm -hmm. for making your quilt. Nice. Okay. And some are for embroidery, like this ones you have seen. Mm -hmm. This is a man bag that uh, we have the sample over there. So I think cushions, you know, a lot of uh, accessories that you need. You know, everything you need for sewing, you find here. Mm -hmm. Right from your thread to your needle to your machine service to quilting, everything mm -hmm. you you have we have them here. So come on and uh, check us out. No, we're waiting for you. We're here to service you.